Hello everyone, my name's David and I'm one of the lay worship leaders here at Kenford. Um, it's a real pleasure to welcome you this morning to our celebration. I'm not sure if I'm welcoming you to a sunny Sunday morning or a wet one. Quite frankly today it's monsoon-like in our back garden. Um, I hope you all enjoyed Pete uh, Hughes' talk on Jesus' wilderness experience last week. Have you had a chance to log in and listen to any of the other new wine talks? Uh, Wendy and I were really, really excited to see what God's doing at the moment and to listen to how much there's an emphasis on prayer and just listening out to what the Lord's saying. So this week, our visiting speaker is Dr. Andrew Ollerton from the Bible Society. He's going to be speaking about the prodigal son um, and taking a turn of the perfect father with it. So later, we're going to celebrate communion together. You might want to go and grab some bread or some, and some wine or some juice. Uh, first of all, we need to clear the decks of stuff that gets between us and Jesus. So, let's quieten our hearts, relax our bodies and listen for his prompting as we ask him to bring to mind anything we need to say sorry for. And it's the stuff that the Bible calls sin. In 1 John 1 verse 8 and 9 it says, If we say we have no sin, we deceive ourselves and the truth is not in us. And if we confess our sins, he, God, is faithful and just and will forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from every kind of wrong. So as we turn to confession, let's not say sorry to God just for our own wrongdoing, but also for that of our world. Let's remind ourselves of his desire as a loving father to forgive us and to bless us. I'm going to use the confession at B52 if you have a C of E service app or are following in the red service book. It begins, Father, we have sinned. Father, we have sinned against heaven and against you. We're not worthy to be called your children. We turn to you again. Have mercy on us. Bring us back to yourself as those who were once dead, but now have life, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. May Almighty God, who sent his Son into the world to save sinners, bring us his pardon and his peace, now and forever. Amen. Now, before we sing How Deep the Father's Love, we're going to listen to a poem by Di Woolbridge. <laughs> 